Hey guys, welcome to a new shit map video. Today we will talk about the importance and more than the importance the relationship between skateboarding and time. Because time is an important matter, time is gold, and if you are a skateboarder, you know that you really need to spend a lot of time with your board if you want to see the progress. So let's get into this video, I hope that you enjoy this skate talk. Alright, today we are talking about the importance of time in skateboarding, and I think that this is all about the approach that we have as skaters. For example, there is the skater that just want to have fun with their skate and who is not taking it too seriously. So, for this type of skater, time is not so relevant and important. But now, on the other hand, there is the skater who wants to be a pro, who is making the athlete pad and who really wants to be the best. And for this kind of a skater, knowing how to use time to their advantage is essential if they really want to make a career in skateboarding. So, the point here is that no matter what kind of a skater you are, what really matters is to keep in mind that time is an important variable that really affects. And in that sense, it would be great if we know how to use that variable in our favor. So, we are here for this. Let's analyze this situation. First of all, we need to realize that in skateboarding, the age when we start is really important. We have seen many examples of amazing skaters that are really killing it nowadays and it is because they started to skate at a very young age. For example, the most obvious case, Naya Houston, who is definitely making history in the skate world, has shown us the effects of what perseverance and discipline can achieve, and beyond that, the effects and the rewards of spending time well in skateboarding. But of course there are many more examples of incredible skaters who are in the same path. All these people started to escape from a very young age, so they have always had the time on their side to really improve their skills and technique to an insane level that absolutely makes the difference if we make a comparison with other skaters that have started to escape from a not so young age. So, in my personal opinion, I believe that a skateboarder becomes really good and really skilled after 10 years of skating, 10 years of living the skateboarding experience. Of course, this is just my perspective, but hypothetically speaking, let's say that it takes at least 10 years to become a really good skater in terms of technique and style. Now, it is not the same thing if we start skating at the age of 5 than if we start skating at the age of 15, taking into account decent years that we need to master the discipline. If, for example, we start skating at the age of 15, that's good. We are young, we have not so many responsibilities at that age, but then life changes and in a few years we will become adults, we will get into the adult life and responsibilities start to come and with them the necessity of producing money. And that necessity will make us consider the amount of time we are spending skating. And in this sense, we will have important decisions to make. Because skateboarding could be the path that will make us produce the money that we want, but at the same time, it could be the path that will take us away from that money because we are spending a lot of time doing something that maybe is not going to take us anywhere. But anyways, it always depends on how talented and bold we are to achieve what we want. Don't you think? Now, on the other hand, let's suppose that you start skating before you are 10, let's say 5. Now you are going to be part of the skaters that have the time on their side. And 10 years later, when you are 15, you are gonna be still very young and with the plus that now you have 10 years of skateboarding experience. And in this way, you are surely going to have more chances to take skateboarding as a career. And of course, as a way of living. So yeah, making a conclusion for this, the age and the time really matters in skateboarding if your dream is to achieve something big from this, talking about the athlete approach of course. But hey, we all know that skateboarding is about perspectives, and the only perspective in which age is an important matter is when we want to follow the athlete path. Because yeah, it is a fact that skateboarding is a very competitive discipline and time will definitely matter if we want to perform well in that competitive approach. But skating is not just about being the best, we all know that the real essence of this is having fun. And to have fun we don't need to be the youngest and we don't need to take time so seriously. We just need to love skateboarding and be willing to enjoy the fun that skating will bring us naturally. No matter the time, no matter the age, no matter the skills, it just matters the fun and the love that we can feel by skating. And that's it. And speaking of this, that's it for today's video guys, I really hope that you enjoy it and I really hope that right now you can give us your opinion about this topic because it's an important matter, skateboarding on time. What do you think about this? 
Please leave us your opinion in the comments down below and let's keep going with this conversation. Remember to like and subscribe and right now let's go skate safe.